Welcome back to Yamo's Reading Room, Jammerinos. Today we're reading another Robert Munch book, one of my favorite authors. This one's called The Boy in the Drawer. When Shelly went into her room, there were socks on the floor, socks on the bed, socks on the dresser, socks on the wall, and socks everywhere. Yikes, said Shelly. What a mess! And from out of the sock drawer, somebody yelled, Be quiet! So Shelly crawled across the floor and very carefully looked into the drawer. A small boy was sitting while reading a book. Shelly ran downstairs and said, Mommy, Mommy, there's a boy in my sock drawer. Tell him to go home, said the mother, and there are socks all over my room. Clean them up, said the mother. But, 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 clean them up, said the mother. So Shelly went back upstairs and looked in the drawer. The boy was gone. She cleaned up the whole room and went downstairs for lunch. When Shelly went back upstairs, there was a large bump in the middle of the bed. She pulled back the covers and there was the boy watering a tomato plant. Shelly ran downstairs and said, Mommy, Mommy, my bed is a mess. Clean it up, said the mother. But, 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 clean it up, said the mother. When Shelly went back upstairs, the boy was gone. She cleaned up the whole mess by herself. Shelly went downstairs and read a book. The room started to get dark. Shelly looked around and saw a big bump behind the drape. She very quietly crawled over to the drape and yanked it up. There was the boy. He was painting the window black. Go away, said Shelly. The boy grew five centimeters. Beat it, said Shelly. The boy grew five more centimeters. Shelly took a paintbrush and painted the boy's ear black. He grew five more centimeters. Help, yelled Shelly, and she ran off to find her mother and father. They weren't in the basement and they weren't upstairs. They were in the kitchen. So was a lot of water. It was all coming out of the bread box. Shelly walked very quietly to the bread box and yanked it open. There was the boy. He was taking a bath. He said, please go away. You're bothering me. Shelly had an idea. She turned the hot water all the way off and she turned the cold water all the way on. When the cold water hit the boy, he jumped up, grew 50 centimeters, and sat in the middle of the kitchen table. The father and mother both said, Shelly, tell your friend to go home. So Shelly said, beat it. The boy grew 10 centimeters. Shelly decided to try something different. Very carefully, she walked over and patted the boy. Right away, he got a little smaller. Then her father went to the table and gave the boy a hug. He got very small. Then her mother gave the boy a kiss and he disappeared entirely. And who will clean up the kitchen, said the mother. And who will clean up the kitchen, said the father. And who will clean up the kitchen, said Shelly. And the mother gave Shelly a hug and the father gave Shelly a hug. And she cleaned up the whole mess with no trouble at all. That one was called The Boy in the Drawer by Robert Munch. I really like this book. It shows that with just a little bit of kindness, you can solve all your problems. Thanks for stopping by Yamo's Reading Room, and make sure to check out more Yamo Reading Room stories. Bye, Jamarinos!